Parker, how come the game loop isn't running? You're not gonna believe this. Somebody stole our demo PlayStation! Wait, it's bad enough someone's stealing the PlayStations from the back. Now the one out here is getting ripped off? I don't know! But this store theft is really getting out of hand. I've got good news. Some of you are not getting fired. There's been some theft in this store, and it is time for heads to roll. Uh, Mr. Carlini? Uh, yeah, what is it? Y you. I just started last week. Are you gonna fire me? Only if I have to. Now, any more questions? I'm, I'm good. Now, get out there and do your jobs for once. Chad. Yeah? Can you believe that, Mr. Carlini? I don't know why he busts our chops so much. I'm just glad I'm going snowboarding this weekend. I thought there wasn't any snow. I hacked the mountain cams. That's why I'm going this weekend for free. Hey, Calvin. Uh, yeah, yeah. W w w what is it, Mr. Carlini? I just want to let you know, as a courtesy, you're fired. Fired? What did I do? D d don't get all technical on me. I told you there have been thefts around here, and if I don't fire somebody, I'm gonna lose my job. Mr. Carlini is in trouble because of all the store theft, so he's using it as an excuse to fire people. But, but I'm like a perfect employee. Look at me. I, I'm squeaky clean. That is the point, Squeaky. It's always guys like you who are doing it. Well, well there has to be something that I can do to save my job. Well, <clears throat> now that you mention it, I might have a little project that you could do. <laughs> I can't believe he thinks we're stealing stuff. I know. Has he always been that way? I don't know. He's just been really weird about it lately. Well, are customers taking stuff? Because I don't want to get blamed. I don't think it's the customers. It's like whole boxes of merch. Oh, hey, Chad. How was work today? It was okay. Ugh, my boss is being a jerk. Well, you know, bosses can be that way. Hey, what are you doing on the computer? I'm trying to rent some snowboard gear. I want to go riding this weekend. Snowboarding? You can't go snowboarding yet. The mountain's not even open yet. Yeah, Dad, I hacked the mountain cams. In fact, why don't you take me? You know, a little father-son bonding thing. Forget this father-son bonding thing. I've got something important to tell you. Really, Dad? Uh, what is it? I met a woman. She's really special. I'm ready to make the leap. I want her to move in with me. With us? No, not with us. With me. Three's a crowd, and it's time for you to move out. Uh, first you and Mom split up, and now you want me to move out? Yes, you need to move out. But there's no rush, as long as you're gone by tomorrow night. What? Tomorrow night? How am I supposed to afford my own place on Big Mart pay? Why are you asking me? It would be unfair to Vicky if I gave you money. Dad has a new girlfriend and is throwing Chad out of the house. But where is he going to live? <sighs> Come on, Dad. The electronics department's over here. Hey, Calvin, where are you going with those? Uh, Mr. Carlini wanted me to take care of them. But those are hot right now, and we just got them in stock. I'm not taking them, I, I'm just moving them. Well, how are we supposed to sell them if they're not in the shoe department anymore? Hey, I, I don't make the rules, I just follow them. Okay, this place is so messed up. PlayStations? We finally got them back in stock. Yeah, looks like I'll never get one though. Why not? I'm gonna have to use the money I've been saving up to find a place to live. Really? I think rent costs more than a PlayStation. I know. I don't know how I'm going to afford a place with what they pay here. Looks like you're going to need to get a second job. Unless... Unless? Unless what? Unless you want to move in with me. I've been looking for a roommate. Really? Can I afford that? It depends. How much cash do you got? Well, I got about 300 bucks saved for a PlayStation. Well, it's going to take more like 500, but that'll do for now. Great. When can I move in? Tonight. Just bring me the cash when you're done at work. Thanks, Slater. Oh, you're so cool. I know.
Looks like Chad found a place to live. He's going to move in with Slater. <laughs> hey Zach, where are you going with that? Oh, this? Mr. Carlini wants me to put it in his car. His car? Are you sure? Yes, yeah, car. Why do you think his name's Carlini? <laughs> hey, Maria! Where are you going with that? It, it, it's a it's return. I was just putting it back in small appliances. Oh, yeah? Then why are you by the front door? You aren't stealing it, are you? N no, it's because the return's right over there. Too late. I'm going to have to fire you. You're firing me? I haven't even done anything wrong. Look, stuff has been getting stolen, and so corporate says that somebody needs to be fired, and it's either you or me. I swear I haven't stolen anything. I even use my employee discount. Is there anything I can do to save my job? Well, I tell you what, there is a special project you can do for me. Okay, Mr. Carlini, whatever you say. <laughs> You're lucky I'm so nice. <laughs> Did you hear Carlini is firing people at random? Yeah, he fired Andrew yesterday for no reason at all. Everyone says he's doing it just to save his own job. Yeah, you know his favorite expression, fire or be fired. I can't believe Carlini's having me do this. Attention customers, Big Mart is now closed for the day. Thank you for shopping at Big Mart and we'll see you tomorrow. Hey Slater, thanks for meeting me after work. I'm all ready to move in. Good, I got the place all ready for you. You got the cash? Yeah, 300 just like we talked about. We talked about 500. But I guess 300's fine, for now. Cool, let's go. Perfect. Ah, here you go. What's this for? Do I have to sleep on your couch? No, man, you're camping right here. Wait, I'm supposed to live here at Big Mart? Yeah, man, that's what I do. What's wrong with that? But you said I was gonna be your roommate. You are. Except you're gonna sleep here in sporting goods, and I'm gonna be over in furniture. What? That's a rotten deal. Well, that's the deal we made. Night, night now. Slater just ripped Chad off for $300. Now he's stuck living in the store. You know what? I'm thinking about quitting. Yeah, I know what you mean. I'm sick of Mr. Carlini and his special projects. Special projects? Does he have you doing that too? Mm-hmm. I just wish somebody would catch him. I know. If only there was some way to hack into the security cameras. I'm calling you all here because theft has gone too far. Therefore, you're all fired. Fired? All of us? I don't think so. You don't think so, Chad? Well, you're right, because I am keeping Slater. He is the only one here with a level head on his shoulders. Yeah, did you hear that, Chad? Yeah, I heard it. Do you happen to have that security footage? Oh. Mr. Carlini, did I mention I hacked the security cameras? Look, I need all this inventory loaded up tonight before anybody finds out. What? What is this? And you better get as much as you can because they do not pay me enough to work here. Oh, Mr. Carlini, it looks like the customers are looking at it. Don't worry, I will keep firing people so that they don't figure out that I'm involved. Chad, you turn that off right now. Oh, I'd like to do that and all, but... Oh, did I mention I also sent that footage to District Manager Bergen? 
Bergen? What's he gonna say? I don't know. Let's find out. I just saw the security footage. I guess now we know who the thief is at our store. And you know what they say about either you're fired or I'm fired. Yeah, yeah, but, but that's just an expression. Well, it's an expression you're gonna have to live with because you're fired from Big Mart. What? <laughs> <laughs> I knew he was no good. Chad spent the night at the store and caught Mr. Carlini stealing. But what happens at another Big Mart when a customer gets accused of taking a PlayStation? I gotta get something for your little sister. I don't care what it is. It's not more important than a PS5. <sighs> Come on, Dad, hurry up. Look, slow down, okay? I'm buying something in the kids' department. I'll meet you by the PS5s. Yeah, this is the right department. I wonder if they have... There it is! Um... I understand you've had some theft at the store? Yes, that's right. We have quite a bit missing, which is so unusual because our cameras didn't pick up a thing. Yeah, it looks like there's a mall bandit hitting quite a few of the stores. Well, hopefully you can catch him and get our jewelry back. Well, we'll do our best and let you know. Thank you so much, officer. Uh, is, is this where I go to buy the PS5? What's a PS5? PS5, you know, PlayStation 5. Oh, PlayStations. Yeah, we used to sell a lot of those. Yeah, I'm sure you did. Well, you're going to sell another one today. Oh, wow, that's cool. I wonder when that's going to happen. Oh, no, dude, you don't understand. Your name's probably Dude, right? Oh, no, man. It's Brody. Well, Brody, I'm the one who's going to buy a PS5. Oh, okay. So when are you going to do that? Um, like right now. I'm waiting for my dad to get over here with the credit card. Just let me know when your dad gets here and I'll have the manager go in the back and get you one. Can't you just get one right now? I'll check with my manager and I'll be right back. Thanks, dude. I mean, Brady. I'm here because we had a report of some problems here at the store. That's right. We have a lot of missing clothing and can't figure out why. Yeah, we've had some reports of a mall bandit, but he usually goes for high-end merchandise like jewelry and electronics. Our clothes aren't really considered high-end, but it's what all the young customers want nowadays. Well, if we find him, we'll let you know. Uh, hey Liz? That's Mrs. Porter. Oh, Mrs. Porter. We have a customer that wants to buy a PlayStation 5. Will you tell that customer to get in line? Where's the line? No, it's a virtual line. Don't you understand? Oh yeah, I understand. What's that? There's a long wait. Your customer's gonna have to order one. How do they do that? They have to charge it to their card on file with their PLUS membership. Oh yeah, PLUS membership. Good, go tell them. I'm doing inventory. Oh, okay Liz. It's Mrs. Porter. Jaden, there you are. Is this where they have the PS5s? Yeah, there's a dude getting one out of the back right now. Good, because he needs to hurry up. We have more shopping to do. Oh, dude, is that your dad? Uh, yeah. Can we have our PS5 now? We don't have any. There's one over there, I just played it. Oh no, that's a demo. It's for like, customers and store employees to play. Why don't you like, go get it? Because this customer like, wants to play it at his house. Sorry man, no can do. You're gonna have to order it. Can we like, order this and like, get this over with? Oh sure man, I just need your plus membership number and a credit card. Wait, if we order it, when are we gonna get it? I don't know. Probably by next Christmas? Next Christmas? Do you mean this year? Oh no man, get real. I don't think Santa's bringing one this year. Oh, forget this. Let's just order it and see what happens. Well, they're probably not gonna charge me till it comes in, so fine. What's this about a plus membership? Oh man, it's only 99 bucks and it's for a whole year. I gotta pay $99 just to order a PlayStation? Yeah, but it comes with a lot of other things. I just don't know what that is. Come on, let's just get out of here. Dad, I'll never get one if we don't order it. Why doesn't he just sell you the one back there? What? There's a PlayStation? Yeah, sell me that one. I'm gonna have to go ask Liz. 
Who's Liz? Oh, that's my boss. Well, hurry up and ask her then. Okay, just don't go anywhere. Jaden wants to order a PS5, but his dad doesn't want to pay the membership fee. Now, you're not calling about a theft issue, are you? Yes, I am. Someone is sitting our cakes. What kind of a person takes electronics, jewelry, women's clothing, and baked goods? You don't understand. Our cakes and cookies are the best anywhere. Well, hopefully we can catch the perpetrator. Mrs. Porter? What is it? Oh, uh, a customer found a PS5. Can I sell it to him? My nephew ordered that six months ago. If you like your chop, you leave that one alone. Oh, okay. I'll tell him. Thanks, Lit. Mrs. Porter. Oh, bad news, dudes. I can't sell that one. Why not? Yeah, it's one right there. Oh, yeah. That's for somebody else, man. You want to go ahead and order yours? No. Forget this. But, Dad, what are we going to do now? I am going to go pay for this. You take this to the car. Oh, hi, Aunt Liz. Hi, how is my favorite nephew? Did my PlayStation 5 come in? It sure did. <laughs> Let me go and get it for you. I'm so excited to finally get it after waiting so long. What? Where is it? I'm sorry, you won't believe it. Your PS5 is gone. What? I've been waiting five months for it. I know. We're gonna find out who took it. I hope you do, because I'm really disappointed. I'm gonna call the authorities. The last PS5 is missing. Who could have taken it? What's this about a missing PlayStation? Yeah, and I think I know who it is. Well, do you have any proof? We have security footage of the kid who did it. <laughs> well, it doesn't get any better than that. Do you know where he is now? As a matter of fact, I think he's still in the store. Follow me. There he is, outside the store with the PS5. That looks like a bedding or something. That's where he must have hidden it. Well, that doesn't seem like much proof. Is there anyone else who could have done it? No, there's no one else that had access to it, besides him and the store employee. Come on, Dad. Can we get out of here? Hold up, I'm not just shopping. Everything is on sale this weekend. Excuse me, son. I need to have a word with you. Me? What's this about, officer? The store says you took a PlayStation. You need to come with me. I didn't take a PlayStation. I wanted to buy one, but they wouldn't sell it to me. Uh, do you have any proof? Apparently there's video evidence, so let's get this over with. Dad, what should I do? Don't worry about it, okay? We'll sort this all out. Uh, not you. You can see him during visiting hours. There you are, son. Dad, do I get to go home now? I don't think it's going to be too much longer now. Thank goodness, because I didn't do anything. Yeah, they came and searched. And guess what they found? Well, it couldn't have been a PS5. That's right. They got a whole lot of nothing. Looks like Jaden didn't take the PS5. But if he didn't, who did? Are you Brody? Depends. Who wants to know? You got something that doesn't belong to you. Dude, how'd you figure that out? All right, kid, want to let you know we caught the mall bandit. It's not me. We know that, and you're free to go. It's about time. And there's someone who wants to speak with you on the way out. Told you so. All right, kid, before you leave, wait right here for your visitor. Jaden, before you go, I wanted to talk to you. Um, who are you? I'm the store manager at Big Mart, and I've got something for you. Oh no, what is it now? A PlayStation 5. Really? Yes, we put one aside just for you. But my dad's not here, I can't pay for it. Who said anything about paying for it? It's a gift for you from the store. Wow! Don't accuse others without all the facts. Remember, things aren't always what they seem.